We're here with Mike Shower following his team's victory at home tonight against Millican University. Coach, talk a little bit about tonight's win. Yeah, I was thrilled with it. Uh, a game that, that you know, kind of had me feeling pretty nervous given the, uh, the way Millican plays. You know, we're, we're kind of similar in the sense that we're both extremely young. And Millican has struggled to score, but it has been really good defensively lately. We have really scored, but have struggled to defend. And, and it was a game I knew they were going to take uh, long possessions offensively, so it, it had me kind of anxious. I was really pleased with a couple things. One, I thought John Panner um, put together a, a fantastic scouting report. You know, assistants spend a lot of hours that nobody sees preparing um, game plans and scouting reports, and, and JP's done a wonderful job this year, and this one really exemplifies that tonight. And then I thought we had a lot of guys play well. I thought Trevor Gunter was, was special tonight. We gave him a lot of defensive responsibilities, which he handled and usually does handle. Um, but when he can find opportunities to score, as he did tonight, um, you know, that just allows me to keep him on the floor longer. And I th just thought he was fantastic. And I thought, you know, as, as I've sort of wrestled with, with how best to use Aston Francis, I thought tonight is a, sort of the model game that I would like him to strive for, which is to get 32 points on 18 shots. I don't think very many people realized that he had 32 because it was a quiet 32. But he also had five assists and no turnovers. That's the game that we need from him. And when he does that, um, we're going to be pretty good because we, we've got a guy who can kind of get offense when, he, when we need it but we don't have to have him taking so many shots. And so I thought that was significant. I thought he played well tonight, uh, uh, as well as, as, as many others. It was just a good quality team win. Coach, your team played well at home tonight. It was the first of three games at home and, and, five, and a six, five out of six overall here in King Arena. Talk a little bit about the momentum that you build off that win tonight. Yeah, we've looked very different depending upon where you've seen us. Uh, in this building, we've been very good and have some real quality wins. Away from here, while we haven't played poorly, we've struggled certainly uh, more so than in here. And, and I think our, our records are almost inverse of one another depending upon where we are. So I knew given the, the conference schedule that we started with, um, where we played four or five on the road, but those three of those four road games were, were at Augie, at Wesley, at North Park, a lot of people are going to lose at those places. So... But I felt like if I could just keep us positive and get to this home stretch here, not saying I'm predicting that we're going to win games at home necessarily, but we're going to be much more difficult to play in here than, than when we go on the road. And, you know, we're really starting to become a pretty good offensive team. You know, we came into the, to the night shooting, uh, you know, over 51% from the floor in conference play, and tonight almost got to 70%. We're starting to become a very difficult team to guard. And if we can just keep progressing defensively, you know, I've been telling people really since the beginning of October, uh, beginning of practices in mid-October, that this team's eventually going to get to be very, very good. Uh, you know, we might have a few ups and downs between here and there, but I think people start to see some of the reasons that I, I remain optimistic.